Welcome to the Kemp IT Law IT Plus vlog. I'm Richard Kemp and this vlog is about the cloud, data protection and the ISO 27018 standard, the first international standard on the protection of personal data in the cloud. As it approaches its first birthday, complying and being seen to comply with the standard is giving real assurance to cloud service customers around their data protection law duties. The biggest inhibitor to cloud growth is trust about security of personal data. Under data protection law, the customer retains responsibility for ensuring that the personal data it processes in the cloud complies with the law. But as the pace of cloud migration hots up, data protection law remains fragmented and uncertain. And it's here that ISO 27018 provides a bridge between cloud take-up and data protection law. In February, Microsoft became the first major cloud services provider to achieve ISO 27018 certification for its Azure, Office 365, Dynamics CRM Online, and Intune services. This shows, first, that ISO 27018 applies to the whole range of cloud services, like infrastructure and platform as services, not just software as a service. Second, Certification also shows that the provider's services are fit for processing personal data, even if the provider doesn't know the customer's data contains personal data. Third, when the procurement group at the cloud customer is running a tender for a large cloud contract, ISO 27018 enables them to grade the bidders and then to include the requirement to comply with the standard as a contractual obligation when the agreement is let. All this becomes more important when the market for cloud infrastructure and platform services is growing at 30% a year, and when cloud enterprise applications are set to rise from a fifth of the total to a third by 2018. If you'd like to find out more about ISO 27018, check out our blogs and vlogs at kempitlaw.com.